In this video, I will show you how to fix the black screen on your Xbox Series S or Series X console. We will be covering a few methods, so make sure to stick around. But before we get into the methods, make sure that your TV or monitor are turned on. If they are, let's get into the methods. For the first method, make sure that the HDMI cable is fully plugged into both your Xbox and TV or monitor. After you've done that, you should also try cleaning up the HDMI port. There might be dust and particles which are obstructing the cable from working properly. To clean it, try using a soft brush or something similar. Be very careful because the ports are very fragile. Do not apply force. After you have done these things, try using your Xbox and see if this helped. If it didn't, move on to the next method. For the next method, try disconnecting any peripherals or storage devices connected to your console. They might be interfering while the system is trying to update the software and can lead to a black screen of death. Only leave the HDMI and power cables plugged in. Then try powering on your Xbox and see if it helped. If it didn't, move on to the next method. For the next method, make sure that you have selected the correct source on your TV or monitor. Most devices have HDMI 1, HDMI 2 and so on whenever you try to choose a source. You can see which one you should pick by checking the back of your device. It usually is written on there. Another thing you should try is switching to another HDMI port on your TV or monitor. If this didn't help, you can always try changing the cable as well. Now you can try and use your console after you have done all of that to see whether the issue has been fixed. If it isn't, go to the next method. For the next method, turn off your Xbox. To do that, press and hold the Xbox power button for about 5 to 10 seconds and after it's off, unplug it from the power outlet, wait for 10 seconds and then plug it back in. You should try plugging it directly into the power outlet instead of using a power extension lead. If you aren't doing that already, this might be a reason for the Xbox to not turn on properly. Now try using your Xbox and see if this helped resolve the black screen. If it didn't, go over to the next method. Now, for the last method, try resetting the Xbox display settings. To do that, you will need to hold down the Xbox power button and the pair button on the Xbox Series S or if you're using the Xbox Series X, you will need to hold down the power button and the eject button. Now let's press them down and you will need to hear the boot sound twice, then you will need to release and after you hear it, you release. After you do that, a screen should flash real quick on your output device and it should turn off. After that happens, just power on your Xbox as normal. Then once you get in the console, most likely your resolution will be set to the lowest one available and you will need to change it to one that works for you. To do that, press the Xbox button on your controller, then navigate to the far right and select the avatar, scroll down and select settings right here, then go into general in the left, then scroll to the right and select TV and display options right here. Open that up, and right here on the left, you have the resolution section. You select that and you select the exact resolution that you want to use. That is it for this video. I hope we helped. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.